What's up guys? Welcome back to an episode of How to Style. Every Sunday, we are styling. Today, we are styling bomber jackets. Can I get an amen? Hallelujah. This is probably the most requested, <laughs> requested style of all time, so I'm doing it. I decided to style bombers the day before. So yesterday, I was like, bombers. And I have straight hair today, so we're working with it. The thing I love about bombers is that you can take a plain t-shirt, jeans, and like throw on a cool bomber and there's your outfit. I have that pink song stuck in my head. I'm just like a pill. Do you keep singing it? No? For my first bomber, I got this guy from Topshop. I saw this and I was like, sequins, stripes, bomber, I want it. And it's one of those sequins patterns that like you go like that and it changes color it's got white and gold underneath a lot of you are requesting that I tell you guys the sizing that I'm getting just so you can kind of know for yourself I got a zero US zero in this I just think this is so cool to dress down I love taking sequence blazers and like dressy outerwear and kind of styling it down making it fun I paired that with this pleated midi skirt that I got from H&M. I put it in my haul a while back. This is online right now for $14. So I suggest you go get it. This is so easy with ankle booties to style for fall. And I styled it with just a plain black ankle booty. My good old faithfuls that I need to get, take to the shoe place and get fixed because they're coming all apart because I've completely worn them out in the past few years. What are you looking at me for? Oh, and in this skirt, I got a size two. Outfit number two, I got this mermaid looking bomber from Zara. I thought this was so cool. It reminded me of a mermaid. It's metallic, it's green, it's got some silver in it. I love this so, so, so much. It's got this like waxy coat to it. And I put a white t-shirt underneath it. I added some light wash denim. I did my DIY uneven hem H&M jeans. So I really liked the color contrast of both of the light pieces. I thought they balanced out really nicely. Then I added my Cecile boot from Free People. This boot is so comfortable. They're an amazing color, an amazing boot, so comfortable, low heel. I thought that the brown tied in nicely with the zipper detailing. In this jacket, I got an extra small. I did my just basic green bomber from Forever 21. I know not a lot of people like sequins and metallic and crazy stuff like that. So I did add just a plain simple bomber for my third outfit in a size small. I kind of steered away from my basic top underneath and I went with my striped shirt from Zara. Then on the bottom, I added just a plain black skirt. I kind of wanted to make it a little bit girly since my shoes and the jacket are a little bit more on the edgy side. I thought I would add a skirt to kind of throw things off and add just kind of a girly piece, something unexpected. You could do black denim, you could do um, black shorts, whatever you prefer. And let me just tell you about my shoe disaster today. I was so excited. I ordered these boots from Zara. Actually, one of my lookbookers on our Facebook group posted a photo of them. I fell in love with them, immediately went and ordered them. So excited. I wore them just to shoot today. This popped out. This one also popped out. Completely broken, I'm so mad. So I just wanted to let you guys know so you see these linked below. Do not order them because I, I wore them for maybe 15 minutes and two things already snapped off, so. Just surprising, I have so many pairs of Zara shoes that I wear all the time and They'd held out for years and these like 15 minutes and they just like fall apart. Outfit number four, I grabbed this bomber from Zara and I love it. The faux fur with sequins kind of mixed into it, almost like a fish scale. I just love the look of this on. It's oversized, um, but it's it's not long, so it, it's not overpowering on your body. Press this down to the bone. I just paired it with a basic black t-shirt and a pace, pace it, a basic pair of black skinny jeans, high-waisted, tuck the shirt in, done. These are my BDG high-waisted from Urban Outfitters, AKA like, my go-to favorite black skinny jeans. I buy them every year. Size 25. So these are the high rise twig, size 25, length 29. Let's go ahead and get into the lookbook because we all know that that is the best part. Love me 
A secret light will get lost in a dream. Halfway locked in a dangerous rhythm, caught me walking on, walking on air like. Don't hide away. Oh, 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 oh. Feel the earth shake. I'm awake. You're crashing into my bones. filming it even though it was freezing I have a feeling this is gonna be my favorite lookbook so far so I hope you loved it speaking of bombers and styling don't forget to sign up for my lookbook my life by her lookbook it is a email directly sent to your inbox once a month of a magazine style lookbook that I put together outfits designed by myself a video explaining the outfits inspiration photos we have a private Facebook group like friends <laughs> We share advice, like, I'm like constantly on this Facebook group. I'm like obsessed with all of you guys. I love you so much. Sign up for that. The link will be right here along with my social media handles. Yeah, so that is all I have for you for this video and I will see you in my next video. Bye. How are you gonna buy a cookie and not ice cream? You're, you're kicked out of the video. Can't kick me out. Bark diet root beer. It's Bargs. It's Barks. That's a G. That is a Q, man. That is a G. What's up, guys? We are gonna get started with our Q&A.